Okay, so before we start, I'm going to teach you how to read the numbers, which is a very important um, topic that you need to learn to lay a strong foundation. So there are a few critical numbers in uh, ClickBank that uh, ClickBank tell you how popular is that product and for you to consider. So the first number, the first matrix is called the gravity. So gravity means the higher is the gravity, the more sales recently the products has been selling. So you want to promote something that has a quite a good and strong gravity number, but not so high, not very popular. Um, I'll tell you why in the next few lesson. Um, and very important, you must not promote a product with gravity zero. It means that for a long, long while, there haven't been any sales for that product. Okay. And the next thing is the initial dollar per sale. So this number will tell you if someone were to purchase this product, how much you will get paid. Okay. And uh, average dollar per sale. Uh, this one I will share with you more in a, in a second. And average rebuild total and average percent rebuild. This is more for the recurring commission component. So let us go to the ClickBank website. Okay, now we are at the ClickBank website. Let's take a look at this top converting pregnancy product. So for this product, we can see that the gravity is here. GRAV gravity is 28.68, which is a uh, quite an ideal number that uh, we are looking for. Okay, for this direct linking strategy that I'm going to share in this video, we are going to look for product with gravity from more than zero, anything from more than zero to 60, under 60. So this falls in the range. And uh, okay, the second number is initial dollar per sale. So it says $30.24. So it means that if people were to click on your link and buy, you will make $30.24. Okay, so what is this average dollar per sale? And it's $31.61, which is different from the initial dollar per sale, $30.24. This means that if you notice that the average dollar and this initial dollar is different, it means that this product has upsell. Upsell means that when people first purchase the product, then the product creator will offer another promotion or another product at a reduced uh, promotion so this is how you can see that the amount here is different and if we were to take a look at another product for example this children learning reading you will see the initial sale and the average amount per sale is the same so it means that this product has no upsell so when people click purchase and buy this product they check out and that's it okay so just for your information if you see the average amount per sale and initial amount per sale is different it has some upsell uh, components and further products to offer to the customer okay the last metric i want you to take note is this average review amount and average percent review okay this is what i call recurring commission some clipband product has the monthly subscription or monthly membership program. So if your customer were to click your link and sign up this product for recurring or membership, it means that every month you will be able to make a sales commission, which is very good. And uh, not all product have this recurring uh, sales commission. You can take a look at this uh, twice direction two direction arrow this means recurring billing some products doesn't have this icon so it means that this product don't have a recurring uh, component so and this one is very important here it says 75 percent so it means that about 75 percent the the sales okay is the recurring component is 75 percent of the rebuild so which means that if they were to charge hundred dollar every month you make uh, 75 dollars so that's what it means okay so this average percent per sale 75 percent it means that the basic commission is 75 percent okay so these are the more basic uh, numbers that you need to know before you go and explore and search for a product 
that uh, you are interested. 